the NFL on CBS Week 4, and we join you today from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Heinz Field, the Steelers taking on the Cincinnati Bengals. And a first and ten, new set of downs for Cincinnati. Pitch, Rudy Johnson angling towards the sideline, and Polamalu came flying over to make the tackle. It's a gain of two. Troy Polamalu. First round draft pick out of USC one year ago. He's a fast flowing safety, very aggressive, and they know he wants to get his nose up to the line of scrimmage, wants to support in the run. So, one double tight end set, fake the handoff. Palmer throws and almost picked off by Pulamolo. And it would have been daylight the other way for the second year pro from USC. And this is a play they've already run. Down on the goal line in short yardage. You're not going to get away with it twice. Balamalu sitting and waiting for the pass. Oh. Little fake, and Palmer will duck out of bounds. He was hit by Palamalu. Former roommates at USC, they shared. And Palamalu showed the closing speed you'd like to see from a defensive back. Boy, can he run? And he didn't hesitate, didn't break down, didn't go for the, the fake by Palmer. Said, hey, you can throw it, but I'm going to hit you. Tough position, tough situation. Well, whether he likes it or not, he's facing one here. Two, 15 to go in the fourth. And intercepted! Picked off by his former roommate at USC, Troy Pulamolo. Pulamolo is still on his feet. Touchdown, Pittsburgh! Wow. A sea of yellow here at Heinz Field. Troy Polamalu had an interception last week, backs it up with another one this week, a 26-yard return for the touchdown. And during the last offensive possession by the Steelers, Bill Cowher had the defenders for Pittsburgh huddled up. He was drawing up plays. He had a sense he knew something was going on. And Carson Palmer makes the crucial mistake like what we saw in week one against the Jets. The interception slams the door shut on their opportunity to come away with a win. The mistake. And look at Paul Amalu just reading the eyes of the quarterback, sliding down the line, getting into the throwing lane, and then you talk about missed tackles. There's one missed tackle, and these are offensive guys, but you cannot allow him to get into the end zone for a touchdown because that really puts the game away, and he runs over so many people, including his former roommate, Carson Palmer, to punch it in for the touchdown. And, and I got to tell you, Solomon, when Polamalu comes up with a pick, my first instinct is go down. <laughs> they don't even start chancing it. And obviously, Polamalu's got other plans, and he goes 26 yards for the score. Had an interception last week at the first of his NFL career against the Dolphins and gets his second here today. And, you know, he wanted it to be something special. He's reading the eyes of Carson Palmer. See if it takes you to where the ball is. And that's where Troy Polamalu makes the interception. But boy, is he athletic. We already talked about what a hard hitter he is, but showing some quickness and ability once he makes the interception. Open up three and one on the season. Troy Polamalu put this one away with an interception return for a touchdown. Bill Cower has his team headed in the right direction once again as the Steelers win it. 28 to 17 over the Bengals.